is up, er, buddy? Um, I know what you guys might be thinking. I definitely know. What the hell do you mean in that title? What I mean by that title is exactly what I said. Um, basically, um, Yakuza Like a Dragon has a long onboarding process. And, um, I kind of realized that and I was like, well, what if I make that go away and just do the onboarding process myself and start the game whenever stuff like side quests and branching paths actually become available so that's what i did so um as chat rolls in i think i'll honestly um answer their questions and stuff like that so that'll kind of be how i explain um the story and everything like that of this game for anyone who's curious but um just um until that starts happening VOD game, just expect hijinks aplenty because Yakuza is just that kind of series. There's lots of hijinks. Right now, we're on a case to try and save this one prostitute's dad that is in over their head, and we're gonna, and we're gonna help by getting a job to work at the senior citizen home that she's in and holy shit this is one of those things it's one of those things can i use this should i open it yeah use it wait rugged case key to open up the safes okay yeah that's awesome rugged cane oh okay hold on so that's actually not as good, but I bet uh, we could actually get some money off of it. Faded place batons, I don't know. Probably keep an eye out for these safes if I find any more keys. Yeah, that's right, Ichiban. And by the way, this guy's name is Ichiban. Say hello to Ichiban. He is a cool dude. Mm hmm. Let's see, and by the way, there's going to be some um, parts of this game to where I'll narrate it, and some parts to where just voice acting will take over. It doesn't matter if you want to work there. Oh, wait a minute, especially not something like casual. That's a fancy retirement home with best-in-class staff. They wouldn't um, even post openings through Hello Work. So you're saying you can't get us jobs there. Sorry, but no. Damn. Well... I can't get you directly employed by the Sunlight Castle, but there might be a way as contractors. Contractors. Ooh. Their full-time staff uh, doesn't do a lot of the menial jobs. The caretakers are employees, but they go through a temp agency for the rest. It's an agency exclusively for wow. caretakers. Sir. Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Hold on, guys. Uh. Oh, okay. Let's see. That rolls out Kagu-san. Let's see. Unless you're hiding caretaker work. Man, don't get my hopes up like that. But non said Oh! That's right. Because uh, he used to be a nurse. Oh, well, your you, resume says X nurse. That's the kind of experience that they're looking for. You can get to Sunlight Castle pretty easily. <laughs> Hell yeah. Adachi san used to be police, then how about this? Hey, you got an idea? If you could leverage your police experience, a security guard uh, post position might be a shoe in. I could introduce you to the company that runs um, Sunlight Castle yeah. security. Awesome. Wait a sec. I'm the only one left out in the cold. It's gotta be an agency. Oh, I think I know what this is. Mm. Kagusa saying, "Your ex Yakuza, hmm, and retirement house. Well, hmm. Oh, what about this? 
I think I know what it is. Oh shit. Are you new? Yeah, I'm from a temp agency. Name's Nanba. How nice to have a new doctor. Wonderful. Sweet. Actually, I'm a nursing assistant. Then just temporarily. You say you do physical therapy? <laughs> Sounds fun. Uh, oh. Listen, Granny. Let me ask you. Well, there's a guy living here named Lakota. You know him by any chance? He's pretty old. Has a daughter. Oh. What time are we having breakfast? Uh-uh. Uh, well, it's already past noon. Oh, here is fine. Thank you, officer. Oh, my God. Hey, did you find anything out? Nope. I haven't seen any guys who were likely to be Nanoha's dad. All right. I gotta say, the care in this place actually seems pretty damn good. There's plenty of staff. The medical equipment is top-notch. But something's up. They've got a security system. Guards too. They ain't skimping on safety. How many times do I have to tell you? I want these toilets so clean. Yep. You let your mother drink out of them. Put some elbow grease into it, for goodness sake. Stop slacking off. Shit. <laughs> yep. Don't laugh. You on toilet duty. <laughs> Why do you think? Well, you're not qualified to do anything else. Did you find her dad? Nah, not even a lead. You find anything? The only thing I've seen all morning is toilets. I'm what just a slave driver? fucking toilets. Maybe your dad's in a special room for the excellent course residents. Maybe. Oh yeah, that crazy expensive program. Doubtful. I found out more about that program. Uh. It has super strict requirements. I don't think she would have met them. For example, you have to do a bunch of interviews to qualify. All right. Interviews. Yeah. I don't know exactly what they ask, but I bet it's all about your family and social standing. A rumor has it her program only lets in big shit. So even if she had the money, uh -oh. I don't think she would have. Hold on, guys. Just trying to uh, make sure that I'm on the up and up as far as everything on the stream goes. There we go. Let's see. That's the interviews. Still. None of us have seen this special room yet, right? <sighs> no, because how are we supposed to do that? Obviously, they're going to have their best security on the excellent course residents. And I heard only full-time staff are allowed to work with that clientele. But where the hell are those residents kept? Top floor. And to get up there, you need one of the full-timers key cards. Okay. Hey! Quit chatting and get back to work! Yes, ma'am. Right away. Oh, yeah, we're, um... Good work. Bet you didn't know toilet cleaning could take up a whole day, did you? So many toilets. <laughs> That's what you need in a place this big. You're gonna have to pick up the pace tomorrow. Damn it. That's not where we want to go. We still need to do the top floor, don't we? That floor is for excellent course residents. It's uh, off limits to us contractors. Oh. That's a purple hair old lady. Hello. Uh oh. Oh, damn it. I, I think I forgot something in the bathroom. Mind if I go get it? Fine, but get it together. You're a mess. All right. I'm and so dang sorry. It. You can go on ahead and I'll catch up, ma'am. Yeah, yeah, just hurry up. Okay. Evacuation route. Oh, this is a fire exit. I do like the expressiveness of uh, all the characters and everything. Like, I haven't seen like this level like of expressiveness in a lot of characters in games as of late. Oh, there we go.
Oh no. No need to be scared now. Just relax. Oh shit. This isn't good. Uh oh. So what's the horrible truth? It'll be over soon. Good night now. Oh Jesus Christ! Take his ass out. Get him, Ichiban. What the hell? Kick the fucking door down. Help the old lady. Hey, guys. Okay. Yo, Kazuka. You're late. Putting in some extra polishes in those okay. bathrooms? Yeah, whatever. Wait, where's Namba? Still working, I guess. Was expecting you guys to take this job so seriously. That said, we gotta find uh, some info and some proof pretty soon. Yeah. I saw something weird at the ex course room, though. Huh? You got up there. What was weird? Hey, guys. I'm so tired I could die right here. Well, Kazuga was saying he caught up on the, uh, something suspicious. Can you put off dying for a few Hold more on. minutes? I can't. I know I'm being a baby, but we can't save it until... T but can't we save it till tomorrow? I'm tired as fuck. <laughs> and uh, they want me to come in early tomorrow. This old woman just passed away, so I have to do all this what crazy stuff. What? What is it? Was that the woman with the purple hair? Y yeah. Oh, shit. Oh, no. They're killing all people. It's crazy to even think this, but it has to be. That woman was killed in the excellent what? room. The excellent room? You're sure? I didn't see it happen, but it has to be. Why would they kill their own customers? A death just means no more income, no. doesn't it? Not necessarily. You could scam their pension payments, for hmm? instance. Pension? Yeah. Someone old does, but you don't report their death, and you just keep going um, on with your life. And hide the body somewhere, and the um, dead person's pension and medical insurance keeps rolling in. You're saying that this institution could be stealing money? Can they do yep. that? Look at this. I checked it out. There's a safe in the back of the security room that has all the residents' bank books and seals in it. For the residents, I'm sure it's peace of mind knowing that they're kept under lock and key. Mm. But if they, um, let's see, if they have that stuff on hand, it's super easy to get at that money. If someone dies, it frees up the room for the next sucker. Every time a patient dies, they increase what? profits. What the hell? I recognize those two. Hmm? Those guys are definitely from the security company. How do you know them? They're both um, Yakuza f uh, from the family that runs the place. They're Yakuza? <laughs> that means they're Saryu yep. clan. They're from the Ryuto, um, Ryuto family. Yeah, okay, I got that right. One of the families uh, served the Ryu clan. I remember them because they used to come by and harass my girls all the time. But about four years ago, they got their hands into another business, and another family took over um, my place. I've heard Yakuza are running a security company as a front before, but I've never heard of them actually being on site themselves. Mm. Wait, what if Sunlight um, Castle itself is the Saryu clan's business? In that case, it would make perfect sense for them to be scamming pensions. Hey. Okay, say um, they're doing this whole pension scheme. Wouldn't that mean that Nanaho's um, dad is long dead? No, Nanaho's dad is still alive. How do you know? Remember that Nana, um, Nanaho son, uh, when she gave the guy 2 million yen? You mean when we were eavesdropping on yeah. it with the phone? Yeah. The guy who took the money said something along the lines of... Three million left to go, then. If you just remit that amount, 
Ten days from now, we can start to carry out the procedure. Uh-oh. Piecing that together, I think that means there's three million yen left. And she has ten days before they can carry out this procedure or whatever. Wait, that would mean... If she doesn't pay the three million in ten days, they'll execute her father. For real? Yeah, they're probably, um... Saying if she doesn't want him to die, then they need to pay I up. See. So her dad's a hostage. Pretty much! <clears throat> but she's, uh... She was able to keep this to the cops. You think? The place is a, uh, um, Yakuza front. They probably got terms with the police. It's pay up or he dies. And even if he does, the police are going to look the other way. And they'll bleed his pension dry. It's Damn. unthinkable. Hold on. How many days ago did you hear that conversation? Oh shit, ten. Then Adachi san's hunch is right. He's going to be killed tomorrow? Three mil. No way, Nanaho could scrape that um, together after the state she's in. I would lend it to her if I could, but that's not the kind of money I have just lying around. Even if you did pay, these are Yakuza. They could double cross you in a heartbeat. True. Well, it's down to the wire. We have to save him no matter what it takes. Her dad's probably in the excellent room. Let's do it. Sorry, I got you dragged into something. Let's see, but all the same, please. You're the only ones who could help. I beg you. <laughs> It's cool, boss. But when everyone's safe, we'll be expecting a full house sure. bonus. Okay, you got it. What's a full house bonus? Is it big? It's an old soap plane custom. If they fill the house, everyone gets a bonus. And if everyone gets a bonus, everyone um, from the ladies and the staff goes home happy. How big is it usually? Well, the gr growing gate is about 3,000 yen. 3,000? We gotta risk our lives for 3,000? I'll have it stuffed and ready um, when you get back, so you better come back alive. Yeah, 30 or 3,000 yen is just $30 American, roughly. Maybe a little bit lower, but we're all technically homeless. Man, tomorrow's gonna be a mess. Let's just get some rest. Hey, you wanna um, take a quick uh, side trip on the way? Where? A place I used to frequent in the bar district. You could drink um, sake and do karaoke there. If tomorrow's gonna be missy, why not throw one back uh, the proper way? Who's buying, though? <laughs> I told you, I go there a lot. I'm sure I could just get it added to my tab. Come on, just one drink. <sighs> All right, fine. But don't get wasted on us. I know, I know. All right, time to get to the karaoke bar. Woo! From whips to canes, we got it all. Come to the um, come to love magic for all your adult weapon needs. Whips and canes, huh? Sounds painful. Might be worth swinging by. Oh, yeah, let's go. Let's go to the adult sex toy store and get some get some stuff to beat the shit out of people with. Hell yeah! Yeah! Oh wow! Whoa! Oh my god! The Ascender number nine. A police baton of dubious origins. It, it was supposed to be a weapon. Let's take a look here. Okay, so... Namba's got almost the best weapon he can possibly get. Wow. Oh, okay. So there's even more. But I guess these are weapons that we don't have access to because we don't have the job for it. Oh, neat! Now we can actually get uh, armor and stuff, too. Okay. Alright, well... We'll, uh, 
uh, whenever we actually get paid, like, a good bit more, okay, so we can't, so we can't sell anything right now. That's fine, though. Who's over here? I see there's a crowd of assholes. Never mind. Eh. Yeah, I may be a janitor right now, but I've got aspirations to be a fucking rock star. And that's eventually what I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be the greatest rock star you've ever seen in your entire fucking life. And it's gonna be glorious. Let's go find some random people. Street fight! I've transformed into my hero mode. Okay. Oh, shit. Are we gonna... Alright, yeah, by the way, this is turn-based RPG shit. Here we go. Beat him down. Yeah. Beat him down with your hobo magic. And by hobo magic, I mean your giant steel fucking... Oh, there we go. Police baton. Fuck you. All right. We did it. Only got 160. Okay. Yeah, I, I don't think it's worth it for us to buy anything right at this moment. Because it's just probably going to be replaced here pretty soon. Although, I could be wrong. Hold on, there's only one. Ooh, okay, Slugger. Ah! Fuck! Okay. Let's go with, uh, Pyro Belch. Pyro Belch power, activate! Okay. All right, Bat Buster. Oh, God. Good. Beat your ass. Oh, perfect block. Perfect block. Get him. Oh, we got 21 bucks off of that. Okay. Moving up in the world. All right, Namba leveled up. Learn the skill Push and Shove. Okay. Namba is the hobo class. While our uh, buddy in the uh, little blazer right there is the um, detective class. Oh. Let's look under here and see if we can find money. All right, we got 10 yen. Fuck yeah. Oh, hold up. Actually... Is that an idea? Okay. Hear me out. We're not going to play the games. At least not yet. Um, I just had the thought that, like, maybe we should start going inside of businesses so that we can get the safes, the silver safes that the key unlocks. Because we have a skeleton key that just unlocks them all. So, we should be able to get at a few of them. It's just a matter of finding them. And learning uh, if they show up on the map or not. We got a paper plate. And a hundred yen. Alright. We're sad. <laughs> Our characters are just in such a sad situation. Oh, okay. Um, is it that we go down here? And the games are... Oh. Okay. Um. Oh, wow. Okay, so it's a gambling uh, ring. Oh, God. Get out of here, Adachi. Get out of here. We're not going to do that. We're looking to see if we can find a damn safe anywhere. Oh. Not a safe, but mysterious compost. Okay. Hmm. Oh. Tarinner? Okay. Something tells me that if we even tried to sell stuff, it's just not gonna 
be that good a deal for us. Oh, shit! A silver and a gold. Yeah. Sweet. Fuck yeah, open it. Stone... Stone orb. What's that? Let's see, post for cultivation. You probably harvest something from this. Oh, might be worth some change at the pawn shop. Okay. So what was the stone orb? Is it a... No, it's not an accessory. I'm confused. What is it that we, uh, that we just picked up? Growth that? Oh, wait a minute. They can... Oh. Yeah. Let's do that. Stone orb. Huh. Maybe it's... Maybe it's a weapon for somebody? But nobody uses a quote-unquote orb as a weapon, so I don't know what to think about that. There's a gold safe now that we know where it is, so if we ever run across a gold key, we'll definitely go back and get that. Something tells me that item is going to be very valuable to us for some reason. Because uh, the thing about this game is that um, a lot of just very random stuff is actually spectacular because of Ichiban's, um, Ichiban's imagination. Oh, wow. So this is, this is actual shit. Whoa. Smart robe. Okay. Royal sword replica. Wow. Damn. Iron club. I got off. Yeah, blow it at your ass. Another paper plate, okay. Um, hold on, before we do that, do we have anything for MP? We do, okay. Uh, oh, wait, that's what I wanted to do. Okay, we might be able to do this. Ooh. Push and shove. Take your best shot. You're in it now. Oh, there's a WrestleManiac. Oh shit. Oh okay. Alright, let's do uh the mega swing and it'll hit everybody. <laughs> <laughs> 